just sort of maintaining your presence in the world. And while, you know, there isn't It can help to meditate. 
yogic breathing can relieve symptoms of tinnitus and is also a self-soothing technique that can help you relax ground yourself and reconnect with who you are and how you feel okay. there's this so we're bringing that tone up or down to a C. If at any point it feels uncomfortable or you want to stop, just let me know. So you should start to feel consistent tone. Yeah. Okay. Put that away. So, one of the contributing factors to tinnitus can be a buildup of earwax. Impacted or whatever too much. Not when there's too little. That's what we're going to do. I'm going to use this syringe to suck up a bit of olive oil. Gently heated, not boiled. And we're going to just pop that in one ear at a time. Okay. Do that. I'm going to practice some sensory diversion techniques that we can use. Okay? Let's do your left ear first. Alright. Okay. Here we go. Alright. How's that? Okay, if you tilt your head to the right, you're right. And just let that wallow in there. In the meantime, <clears throat> just with your eyes, don't move your head. Follow my finger. Okay. So, very good. Up. Down. Sensory diversion is a technique used where we distract the other senses so that they don't pay attention to others. So tinnitus, although it's your inner ear, it can sound like it's coming from an external source. So what we do is we distract you with something else like my finger so that you're not concentrating on that sound. Let's do the other ear. Let's see him tilt your head back. Okay. So now all the oil's in there. I'm going to take 
this little device.
so at the very least your ears should be feeling cleaner so next is some very light visual aversion or distraction again this time we're going to use a light and I don't know if you know you probably do but if you need to sneeze something you can do to pull that urge back is look up at a bright light same with yawning it kind of stimulates that sense to distract you from the other so what we're going to do is not following the light very closely
shake it down a bit, relax. You have to do it It's kind of weird, right? But for some people, for me, you can, you can do it to yourself. So just hands basically together like that, four fingers on top of middle finger, on the back of your head. 45, 50 times, whenever you get it, it could help, all right? So, finally, what we're gonna do, oh, the reason I didn't count backwards is because I mess up numbers when I count them backwards. Um, I've never been good with numbers. I just, it's not like I can't count. I certainly don't count backwards very well, and I didn't want to look like a fool. Last thing we're going to try is just simple temple massage, some face pul fa face palpitation, palpation, pul and then some lymph node. Because sometimes tinnitus can be the result of a headache, or it can be the result of tension, or even sometimes an infection. All right. So let's start with your temples. Is that okay? Cool. Very gently while the plane flies over. And while I'm doing this, if you just relax, you can close your eyes if you want. And if you drift off, it doesn't matter. I'll leave you alone. You can just have the room for a little while. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if you can, just try to concentrate on your breathing. So just in and out. Doesn't matter. Just for you know. Lift your head up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Thank you. I'm just gonna squeeze the base if you real up. Okay? At the same time. Sweet dreams. <laughs>